What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. And we're gonna continue where we left off. So we gotta go find the professor. So I can act like I don't know where he is. This lady. Hi, lady! Hey! You, you two! Not another step! Don't come this way! Oh, okay. Trick, I just, just bumped into me and made me lose a contact lens! Whatever you do, do not move an inch. Switch. You stepped on it! I broke out that thing! I did not! Oh shit. Oh man, I'm so thrilled to be playing it. Dungeon, um, my file actually got corrupted, so I'm actually not able to play it. Um, and I'm, I'm really buttered about that. I actually love that game a lot. Um, but. Fuck! Hey, what's a beat, Pap? Yeah, I'm talking to you. Yeah, I have to go get my stuff. That's my point. Oh, shit. So, um, yeah, I'm. I'm not going to be able to continue Sakura Dungeon. I mean, I can try to do some fixing, but I'm not really good with it. But, uh, I'll do what I can. So, bear with me on that one. But, uh, for right now, I'm just going to be playing a bunch of different other, uh, bunch of other games. Hey, you! Uh, nice to meet you here. <laughs> uh, you're pretty dang persistent, buddy. <laughs> what a pain. Fine, fine, okay. Uh, keep back here. Thank you. But, um, uh, I'm gonna work on, like, I did a bunch of, uh, Fruity Grisia, but all my files got corrupted. Uh, so, I'm kinda stuck in that regard. But, uh, don't worry, uh, I'm gonna get it back together, and the game's just getting a lot better. Like, trust me, you're gonna be interested to see what's coming next. But, um, yeah, so, um, I'm thinking of doing a Minecraft series. Um, I might just do a vanilla, or I might just go online and do a bunch of things, but, um... Oh, here's the Professor. Hey, hi there, Professor Franklin. What? Who's there? You, you must be. Ah, yes, you. Now, you, uh, see a fish before. Yes, uh... What sort of air brings you to the, all the way to a place like this? 
We were hoping you'd tell us about the legendary treasure said to be below Roqueport. I thought that if it... You would, Professor Frankly. Oh, of course I know about it! The reason I came here was to study that very subject! But, why do Tykes want to learn about the legendary treasure? You know that most say it's a little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Archaeologists and historians have to search for the truth in these fairy tales, though. Me, I believe the legendary treasure truly does exist, and I really want to find it. Well, hey, in that case, I'll cooperate with you however I can. First of all, about the treasure, there are many mysteries surrounding it. Some say it's an infinitely vast treasure of horror, while others say it's a magical item. Some books say it's actually a monster, while still others claim it's an empty chest. So many different theories, obviously it's impossible to divide the truth among them. But at one point to find the treasure, one must have the crystal stars. I'm seriously losing my voice. Are that old saying that super elderly people pass down? Indeed, the same as the saying goes, if you want to find a legendary treasure, you must first click stars. Hold on, the magical map, the loft before the entrance to the thousand year door, and the stars will light the way that leads to the stones of yesterday. Yeah, a lot of the lore I've read says that if this magical map is taken to the doorway, then it will show you where to find the crystal stars. Correct! And the thousand year door is supposedly here deep beneath this tower. Yet the critical piece of the puzzle, the magical map, is lost. If only I had that map. But we do have it perfect. Well, not we exactly. Mario has a magical map. <laughs> yes I do! Okay. We can 
Jesus, is piping down under the sin's teeth. Come on, Wolfie, let's get moving. Okay, on my way, Grandpa. Oh wait, hang on a second, Mario. Something just occurred to me. I'm fairly certain there are quite a few hoodlums below, so uh, keep your guard up. Damn hoodlums! Last time I went down there, they took my danger. But I found them. Nope, well, they don't taste the same. Let me swear now. Really? You know the best. We gotta practice them once. Should be safe. Well, old young lad, aren't you? <laughs> Reminds me of me in the day. I remember getting squashed by a red guy, but I didn't die. <sighs> Wait a minute. Oh, whatever. I just might be imagining things. Maybe it was a dream. Oh no. My uncle got squashed by a red guy. That well, was for sure. Yeah. He was just patrolling a nice red block brick land. Yeah. Poor guy. Alright, right, well then, down we go. Just go. Okay, come on. I simply can't wait around. Let's get the underground. Totally barfing! Now get out of our way. Ouch, but that was cold. What you doing to go for us? Come off it, sister! <laughs> Nobody stings up like that. Nobody! <laughs> Look at that. Goomba, a spiny Goomba, and a pair of Goomba. My, the whole boat starts to creep. A Goomba! Ah! Oh, fuck! A Goomba, a spiny Goomba, and a pair of Goomba. My, the whole Goomba family tree. Oh, shit. <laughs> Only one I should be. Okay, spiny though. Blah, blah, blah. And I can't. Okay. Anyway, be careful of this consideration. Uh, well, that's right. Boing, boing, 
Oh boy, did you fall for it? 
my friends. What? You think I was going to help you? <laughs> and it spread a little of suffering. I've endured in that stupid box. Yeah, sorry, but those now break me. You have cast an evil, a terrible curse upon you. Buckley, buckley, woo! You are cursed. <laughs> Enjoy that curse, sucker. You've got what you deserve. You want to hear all about it? This curse I just dropped. Then listen well. From now on, if you press Y, it suits near you to turn into a paper airplane. <laughs> but, uh, this doesn't sound too bad. I'm already made the paper, so it really doesn't mean too much for me. You <laughs> need it, So for the rest of your days under my terrible curse. <laughs> oh, I can't help but Chortle. You can't help but chortle. You're doomed. This curse is about to my death, so I suppose I owe it to you. Ready? You stand on an airplane like this, close step to death. Yeah, okay. Now press Y. Hey, let's see. You're a paper airplane. Now it's kind of easier for you to get places. Uh. I zoned out. I just zoned out. What was that? Yeah, I got it. It's terrible. <laughs> you might press it. You might press it. Fellow, the foolish fool. Who is foolish? You foolish fool. You are fools. Who are foolish fool? <laughs> oh, well, that was um. So uh. Wow. Just uh. Just just wow. What was that guy's beef? No oh, shit. Well, thank you guys for another episode of this. If you just like it, stay tuned for the next one, because I'm going to continue to make more whether you like it or not, so you're stuck with it. But, uh, yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. This is RickyBish98, signing.